Alright, what's up, Yens guys? Uh, I'm gonna do a video for you here. Um, yeah, I just stopped over the girlfriend's house on the way from work, you know, and had a little dinner, and we watched the news, and yet <laughs> another really funny, weird news just uh, came on the TV screen, and uh, another story. Uh, Anyway, uh, funny as hell story. Yeah, this is some really funny shit here, you know. Uh, in fact, it's so funny, I wasn't even really talking right just now because it's rolling around in my head. Inside my head, I'm... In my mind... Okay, excuse me. In my own mind, I'm rolling all over the floor laughing my ass off. So, I'm having a hard time talking in this video. Oh, this... <laughs> The only thing I was able to say is, dude, damn, dude, okay. Okay, anyway, and the news story goes, this dude uh, asked Miley Cyrus out to the prom on YouTube, which I never seen the YouTube video. I never actually seen the YouTube video. I didn't even know about the video because I'm too busy with my own shit, my own videos, and I can't even keep up with all my subscribers and my friends and uh, my dislikers and all that stuff and all the stuff I'm interested in and but anyway how the it this they said this went viral it supposedly went viral how the hell did I miss it even with how preoccupied I am but anyway uh, they showed a picture of him I guess he had his uh, groin area covered you know by one of those you know uh, uh, superimposed uh, finger uh, things, you know, like that people wave around, you know, in sports, you know, in uh, in the stands, in the, you know, you know, waving, you know, different items you can wave around for sports, but he had his groin area covered with one of those, and, and he asked, publicly asked Miley Cyrus to uh, go to the prom with him, and I guess she let him down politely and says no and stuff like that, but, uh, <sighs> um, I'm thinking in the lines of uh, later on, you know what I mean, the rest of the school. I'd like to be a, I'd almost like to be a fly on the wall in that, and at their school. What this poor kid is going to go through eventually when he realizes, I, I don't know what some of the dudes might think, you know, some of his close friends might, that are really into her, you know, and if they talk to her and stuff. I mean, if they talk about it, if you get a bunch of dudes that talk about it, they might, some of them might be saying, thumbs up, way to go, but then, most of the school, you know, <laughs> all, uh, mental I ain't gonna bore you with all that, you guys probably get a couple different scenarios that are probably transpired if you can be a fly on the wall out there, but, uh, m my opinion on it is, uh, <laughs> he could have went in about it in a little bit of a better way, you know, and I mean, I mean, how would he even my honest question, you know, not to make a video to actually a attack or alienate him in any own way, or but I can't help it. It's funny. I mean, this this shit's funny, you know. Um, but uh, even you know, it could have been done a better way. I mean, some kind of holding flowers out, and why the. <sighs> nakedness and covering your groin with a whatever that you know item was well for all we know he could have been wearing underwear under there or he could have been wearing you know a a, um, a swimsuit or something like that I don't know but that's just one of them things like first this is one of them funny things that you just see on the news and you're like god damn or like they said when the toilet overflowed in the church, uh, holy shit, you know. Um, <laughs> and um, I don't know. <laughs> uh, that that would be scary before you do something like that to think that, you know, would you know what you're going to be going through later. I mean, uh, not to be, you know, really mean or down on the guy, but when you go on YouTube and did it in the manner that he did, why didn't it would have been why don't you just get it over with and tell all of YouTube and all your friends all your friends and 
on all your dislikers in school, why don't just get it over with and go ahead and tell them that you were looking at Miley and kind of, you know, looking at pictures and kind of, you know. I'm, I'm not being ignorant. I'm just saying that that's what it looks like. That's what every what everybody's going to think, you know, that's the first thing that's going to cross on the mo that's the first thing that's going to cross the mind of all these other teenage kids, and, well, even older adults, like, I worked in, if any of these guys like me worked in factories, or any guys, truck drivers, or, any, wherever you are, you know, I mean, where there's unorthodox behavior, you know what I mean, different kinds that's, uh, that's the first thing that's going to come to people's minds, because that's the way people think, you know, um, you know, but, yeah, I mean, because, you know, the kind of sense of humor even people have, not that I'm advocating either way, I'm not trying to act like I'm too, too moral, but I'm not trying to, that's the fair thing you got to watch, you know, I mean, but, yeah, because I worked in uh, factories before, you know, and I used to, you know, anyway, I used to, we, the kind of sense of humor we actually had, where I'd be getting the shipment of the wood to build my crates, and one of my jokes, I started it, other people do it, and then the joke carried over. I'd say, uh, if you got it, the shipment of wood in the morning, you know, before 12 noon, it's considered morning wood, you know, and, um, <laughs> and, was, and then, you know, when you're building the crate, you get really good at building the crate, and you're building the crates that you were building, you know, with the nail guns, you consider yourself the master crater, you know what I mean, and, um, and if you go fishing with your buddies and you're good at baiting the hook and putting the worm on the hook, you're considered a master at baiting your hook, you know, <laughs> a master baiter, you know. Uh. But anyway, uh, that's the kind of humor, you know, a lot of us are used to being around, you know, whether you're a truck driver or whether you uh, worked in a factory. Um, and then a lot of us teenage kids, you know, it's the factory truck driver related humor, you know, unorthodox as it is, and how it varies, I'm just saying that it's kind of a continuation of when you're in high school, but then whether you go to college or you go off to work in a factory or you get some job or whatever, where you wind up working, that's the kind of humor that other men uh, are kind of into, so the first thing that people be thinking, you know, just to, um, just to get the idea, you know what I mean? Any of you guys watching, you know, the kind of sense of humor we have, it's just... That's just the way it is, you know. Um, <sighs> yeah, the guy... Anyway, the guy got a... Uh, and, um, <laughs> you don't want to... You don't know whether uh, you can say he really uh, got a, a lot of guts or a lot of stupidity or what, but... Uh, well, anyway, uh, what I'm saying is the dude is kind of a dipshit, you know, he isn't your usual, uh, he's just a teenager, he's young, and he's a dipshit, I mean, he's not acting like your usual, uh, like some of these usual, uh, people that are a little bit on the, uh, weird side, I mean, you can tell by looking at this kid, he's just a teenager, and, and he's probably looking at, uh, typical teenager looking at pictures of, uh, whoever he's into, and, you know, uh, and that's the kind of mind he had thinking, you know, um, he's probably going to be thinking later, thinking back on this, uh, years later, I'm like, oh, Lord, what have I done? Oh, God. Yeah. Uh, that's what I actually think, you know, nope, yeah, that's a little bit, uh, I think he went a little bit too far, I mean, he could have done, asked, asked her out with uh, a little bit more clothes on, and say, I'm a big fan fan of yours, can you go to my prom, but, uh, I guess he wanted to get her attention, and make a video go viral, you know, maybe get her attention, you know, because I guess if he asked, you know, uh, any other way it wouldn't uh, work or something, but um, I don't know, I mean, 
Nah, uh, that's yeah. He had a, I think uh, he probably had like a quite a. Uh, <laughs> oh God, I'm not going there. No, 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 no. I'm not going there. Uh, I'm just gonna end this video. I'm just gonna be quiet. I'm not gonna say nothing else. No. Uh -huh. Yeah, when I'm kind of stammering and stuttering like this, that's because I have some of the other ideas going in my head. I'm not, no, no, I'm not going there. Uh, I'm just going to be quiet. That's enough. For, that's it for this video. Yeah.